Hey everyone, in just five minutes today, I'm going to show you how to create three amazing PowerPoint slides that are gonna make you look like an absolute pro. These slides are perfect for presentation covers, and with this tutorial, you'll be able to recreate these stunning effects quickly for all your projects. Now, I'm using PowerPoint from Microsoft 365, and let's dive right in. For the first slide, let's go to Shapes, and then insert a rounded rectangle. We're going to use the yellow dot and make sure to round off the edges. Then we're gonna rotate it about 37 degrees and we're gonna use Command or Control D and make sure to duplicate it. We're gonna make the copy slightly smaller and then place it on the right. Now we're gonna make more copies and we're gonna change their width and we're gonna change their height. Then we're gonna arrange them to create a dynamic and super eye-catching look here. Then we're gonna add a circle shape in the bottom right area, just to have a little bit of variety. And then we're gonna select all of the shapes by clicking and dragging over them. Then we're gonna right click, and then we're going to group them. Then we're gonna choose picture or texture fill under format shape here. And then we're going to insert your picture and then as we usually do, we're going to remove the outline. We're gonna copy one of the shapes and I'm gonna to choose to fill it with a solid color like green and then I'm gonna make a little bit of an adjustment to the transparency and then finally send it all the way to the back. We're gonna repeat this exact process to create a cool layered background look. Then we're gonna add in our title and text to complete the slide and that's it, we're done. So let's move on to slide number two. We're gonna insert a picture that spans the entire width of the slide. Then we're gonna to go to picture format. We're gonna hit crop. We're gonna hit aspect ratio and then select 16 to nine to make sure we're covering the entire slide. Then we're gonna insert a rectangle to cover the left half of the picture and then insert a text box and type in the title that we want in bold font. I use phosphate at size 144. Then we're gonna duplicate the text box and adjust the text size for different sections. And we're gonna add smaller text to the left to create a neat hierarchy. And then we're gonna hold down Command or Control and then select the rectangle first and then all the text boxes. We're gonna to go to Shape Format, we're gonna click Merge Shapes and then we're going to choose Subtract. We're gonna fill the resulting shape with black and then as we usually do, remove the outline. Now let's come to slide three. We're gonna insert a text box and we're gonna type the minus sign 12 times. Then we're gonna to go to shape format. We're gonna click text effects, the blue A, and select transform. Choose the wave one option and enlarge the text box to make sure to cover the upper half of the slide. And then we're gonna copy an image to the clipboard. We're gonna right click on the text we're gonna open format text effects. Then we're gonna to go to text fill under text options and we're going to select picture or texture fill. We're gonna click clipboard to insert our image into the text here. And we're gonna try different uh, transform options and shapes to make sure we're creating a unique and engaging effect. We're gonna add in titles and then other elements as well to enhance the overall design. And that's it. Now you have three stunning slides that are perfect for any presentation. Give them a try and then let us know how they turn out in the comments. I'd love to hear from y'all. If you enjoyed this tutorial, do not forget to like, subscribe, and hit that little bell for more awesome PowerPoint tips and tricks. See you next time.